ranked Florida men's basketball team has been experiencing court troubles as of late. They are now on a three game losing streak after last night's 65 to 59 loss against Loyola Chicago. Welcome back to sports. I'm Jordan Reed. After suffering their first loss of the season against Duke, the Gators spark has been fading. Previously, the Gators led the NCAA in points per game and two losses after Duke. They now sit at number two behind Virginia Tech. Speaking of the Hokies, Tech transfer Jalen Hudson currently leads the Gators in points per game. But last season, but last night, he wasn't even in the starting lineup. However, he came off the bench and put up a team high nine points, matching the total scored by Chris Chioza. That's right, no Gators scored in double digits. Hudson's replacement in the starting five was freshman DeAndre Ballard, who put up seven. Next up, the Gators will face ranked Cincinnati on Saturday. Many teams across the country have been experiencing coaching changes in college football, and no process has seemed to be as lengthy as Tennessee's. The Volunteers fired Butch Jones on November 13th and went through a slew of candidates who turned them down, and fired an athletic director as well, before finally getting their new head football coach. Alabama defensive coordinator Jeremy Pruitt will be the fifth coach at Rocky Top in the last 11 years. This year, the Volunteers went 4-8 and eight with zero wins in the SEC. However, that could change with Pruitt leading the team. Since, two, since 2013, he has had the nation's best scoring defense three times. And in 2016, his Bama defense ranked first overall.